Hello and welcome back to another Dirt 5 video. Uh, today we are going to do a few more races. We've done three in the last episode. If you haven't watched it, I recommend you go check it out. But uh, we're going to go to this one, which is Fushi DG. I don't know my Italian. We're going to Italy, anyways. <laughs> um, so I have to choose one of these cars, and I don't think yeah, I'm still not able to afford any of them. So um, we have to stick with this one. We used that color in the last episode, so just to change up the color, spice things up. We'll try out this color. Hopefully, we, we won in this color in the last one. Last time we used this in the last episode, so uh, hopefully changing the colour won't affect much. Anyways, we'll get into the race. Right, let's see what Italy has to offer. Let's go. I'm ready. Three, two, one, begin. Let's do this. Two laps. I usually do good in the lap ones. I see a break through here. We might have to break. I break too early there. Back. Yes, that's it. There's a lot of tight corners in this one at the start. Here. Right, pick up the speed and power. Come on, let's do this. I'm hitting walls right, left, and center. It's not the best of driving, I must say so myself. Is this a quarry or something? It looks like that. Not up there behind me. I prefer if he stayed behind me. Fact. Right, no harm. There's plenty of time. Fuck. Eee, shit. I f oh, I'm oh, I fuck. I fucked up there on four. Don't let anyone else pass. This is your race for the taking. And from the second wall. Ooh, that is a nice jump. That was nice. That felt good. <laughs> second lap. Not players hitting the wall here. I find my opportunity to overtake them. And it could be here, you know. Right, let's try and take every corner with perfection, or as good as I can, as good as possible. Let's not fuck up. I am first, this is my race for the taking, and I will take it my pleasure. There's a bit of distance between me and the players behind me, the drivers. There isn't a lot though. That wasn't the best corners. Good, good. They're catching up. They are catching up. Ah, oh, this is the jump. Get a bit of air. Yes. On a smooth landing, but we got air. First place, too easy. So 
some players didn't finish. There we go. DRJ plays. Ooh, fifty-four thousand five hundred. Cars on this game are expensive, they're up in the 100 grand, but there's a few of them that are relatively cheap. So we're going to Greece. Again. Ooh. Aerial Nomad. I have 54,500. I can buy some of these. But performance B, handling A. Performance A, handling B. 140 horsepower, 235. I'm going to stick with the Aerial Nomad. I'm going to save my money to buy maybe a, a rally, a rally car. Not one of these type ones. Yep. Let's do this. I started off in first place. I usually start off in last. That's that's a nice change. I'm happy. Thank you very much. And this is one of the other ones, not the lap ones, but the uh, whatever they're called. This aerial nomad is fast. I was not expecting that much power so early on in acceleration. It's from 0 to 60 super fast. Oh my god, that shit, yeah. That was coming. Shit. There's plenty of time though. I did fuck up at the start. Turn and circle listen to all that good actually on it. I'm guessing that's the handling or the performance. Me. Not good. Oh my god, I'm fucking last. Be start. <laughs> nope. I wasn't in first place for too long. Oh my god, the turn on set on this car is appalling. It's horrendous and bad. What was that? Turn and circle on this is shit. Not a big fan of this area nomad at all. Fucking rubbish. I'm gonna use other cars to assist me. Yes, I can. Second place. Right, so this has performance S and handling B. Is S the best performance or is A the best performance? I don't know. Leave it down in the comments and let me know if you know. It's all wheel drive, it has 850 brake horsepower, it weighs 1340 kg, and it has 1000 torque. So I'm guessing. The S performance is the best rank. I don't know. Anyways, let's get into the race and see how this baby drives. I am ready for ya. <clears throat> let's see what you have. Three, two, one, go. It's a lapped one, three laps. I usually do good at these lapped ones. And there we go, I'm first already. That was short lived though. Hopefully we can easily gain that back. 
the controller is vibrating like mad with all the physical contact with the other drivers. Right, back in first place. Let's go. Let's try and get some distance between me and the other opponents behind me. I can tell you now, this vehicle can move. Holy shit. And has a better turn and circle than the Aerial Nomad. So Aerial Nomad, you need to improve your turn and circle. Because it's shit. Oh, big jump. A suspension on this yo, holy shit. Driver mustn't even feel any of these impacts. Shit. Oh, I fucked up back there, I really did. Those corners were not taken well back there. Come on, let's get a gap now between me and my opponents. That would be nice. Big jump coming up. Oh yes. Let's not crash into the rocks like last time. I love this vehicle. This is actually one of the best vehicles I've driven so far in this game. I absolutely love it. Tires on it as well are ridiculous. Look at the grip on them. Big jump coming up. Oh yes. There we are, first place. Let's see what we got. Look at the grip on them, huh? <laughs> 130 XP, that brings us up to level 10. Uh, I'm guessing that was 360 uh, rep, so that's level 10. 92,250 we stand on. Get a few textures and playing cards and stickers. Yeah, thank you. Seven of them. That's great. That's all we've got time for. Um, that's going to be the end of today's video. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of any future uploads. And if you liked this video, please hit that like button. And I'll see you in my next video very soon. Take care.